Hi everybody, Chad here, and I'm going to show you how to set up the SG Home Wi-Fi covert camera system. Uh, we have it on an iPad today. We're going to walk you from the beginning to the end. Nice and easy, quick steps, and uh, hope you enjoy. So uh, first, obviously, you want to download the SG Home Wi-Fi app, which is available at your App Store, uh, which is the Play Store, and the i uh, Store, which is your i i store i believe is what it's called um, anyway so once you've downloaded that you'll come to the home screen here at the home screen you want to create a username and login uh, this is for security purposes it's really important so people can't access your camera as you can see here i've already generated that information i'm going to go ahead and log in uh, once you're logged in it's going to take you to the add camera screen or in the future this is where your camera list is going to be where you can select your uh, already added cameras um, in the top right hand corner you'll see a plus sign uh, this is the add button so i'm going to go ahead and add our first camera uh, what you're seeing here right now is basically the device saying hey we need you to connect to wi-fi um, i'm already connected to our, our local network here i'm going to go ahead and hit next um, at this point it's now asking me for my network password so i don't want you guys to see that so i'm gonna hit this uh, put this in covertly really quick so give me one second All right, now that I've entered the Wi-Fi password, I'm going to go ahead and hit next. Here it's asking me for a secondary password. It's just a security-based password. Uh, just for fun, we're going to put an SG, nice and quick and easy. Um, then we're going to hit next again. At this point, uh, what it's going to want to do is it's going to want us to connect to our devices, our covert devices network. Um, each of these devices creates its own little network. It's called device underscore with a bunch of different characteristics. So we're gonna get this little error and that's okay. What we wanna do is hit settings. And what this is gonna do is take us to the settings or your uh, setup of your actual device that we're using. Uh, we're gonna go to the Wi-Fi, And we're, here we're gonna try to find the devices network setting. So uh, as you can see, we have device underscore and a bunch of different characteristics. That's exactly what you're looking for. Uh, this specific rock. Uh, emits this KJF uh, network. So we're going to select that network. As you can see, it comes up here now and it's going to be connecting. When you get the check mark that will populate here shortly, uh, as you can see, we are now connected. We want to go to back out, which is in the top left hand corner, and it'll take us directly back into the app. Now, the really important thing here is we're waiting for is a indication that we're connected to Wi Fi, which will pop up in the top left hand corner of your iPad or your iPhones. Um, even on your Androids, it'll pop up on the right-hand side. Um, as you can see, currently it's not coming up, and that's okay. It just takes some time to recognize. So what I like to do is just hit Next. And it's going to basically tell me that it probably is going to fail. And that's okay, because I know that we're not connected because I don't see a Wi-Fi signal yet. So we're just going to go ahead and hit OK. Uh, we're going to wait and then see it came right up. So now that we have that little indicator, we can go ahead and hit Next. And we got the amazing and awesome green check mark, which means that we are successfully added our camera. It is successfully on our network and we are good to go. So we wanna go ahead and hit finish. And once we hit finish, it gives us a little error code, but that's okay. Just hit retry. And we're going to connect to the camera. And as you can see, we have a live hit picture and that's me. It's currently in black and white because it has the IR mode on. And I'll show you really quick how to turn that off. So what we do is just want to go into our network settings. We're going to go to our camera settings. And we're going to go to IR and just turn that off. Once that's turned off, your camera will now be in color. Um, so we'll just go back all the way. We'll go back into our camera and there we are. Um, Hopefully this will help you guys set up the devices, give you a greater understanding of how this system works. Um, it's not too complicated, but for the people who are not familiar, I can understand why you have difficulties. If you have any problems, please give us a call at our tech support. Um, as always, we appreciate your business.